In this video, we're going to practice our skills on adding, subtracting, multiplying, and dividing decimal numbers. A couple keys as we go through here. When you're adding and subtracting, most important thing is to line up place values, or some people say line up decimal points, but what you're really doing then is adding like place values. Put a little zero there or a donut there to line things up. 1, 10 carrier 1, 1 carrier 1, 3, 1.01, 1. 6.12, subtract 1.342. If you don't put a zero here, you're going to make a mistake probably. That's a zero or a donut, and we're going to subtract. This becomes an 8, a 7, a 7. This will become a 4, 4.778. When you're multiplying, I don't think about decimal points. So I just put down the two numbers. And then I multiply. And after I multiply, then I put back in my decimal points. There was one right here, and there was one right here. And I say, how many places to the right of the point? There's two to the right here, one to the right here. My answer wants to have three places to the right of the point, so the answer is 0 0.775. Let's do a division problem. We'll set it up for you. 5 and 3 tenths into 22.26. Now, if I was doing this problem, I would not want to use that decimal point in the divisor right here. It gets in my way. So, if I take this problem, which is the one I'm assigned, and I multiply it by 10 over 10, I get 222.6 divided by 53. Why did I choose 10? Because there was one place value after the decimal point. Had there been 2, I chose 100. Now, I'm going to do this problem. 53 into 222.6. So I just have moved my points over one to the right in each of those. Put it up here and forget it. 53 into here will be um, four times, looks like. Two, one. We'll subtract it at 106. That should go there two times. 106. No zero left. And we will just stop right there. Hope that helps you with your basic skills on adding, starting, multiplying, and dividing decimal numbers. As always, have a very happy day.